Hey guys, here's a unique strategy that I use in all my follow-up. When I have a prospect who's really low on the uh, EQ square scale, the emotional quotient, this is uh, then a person that I need to follow up on. They're not ready to do the deal today. They're not ready to sign a contract, do a commitment, give your Uncle Claude money just so he can make Mrs. Claudia very happy. So what do I do? I say, can I have your email? I want to send you a gift. That gift can be a, a book, it can be, and it can be a, a digital book or something, it can be a gift card. A lot of times you can send people gift cards. I just recently gave somebody a gift card who helped, make, uh, helped me solve a really big problem. I do a lot of times when I want to follow up with a prospect, then it can be a $5 Starbucks card or something like that. That gives you the right to call them back the next day. Hey, Mr. and Mrs. Prospect, how was that latte? Did you, did you enjoy that gift card I sent you? Oh, by the way, did you sell your home yet? Would you like to sell it in the next 30 days? Uh, did you have any questions for me? Boom. It gives you the right to go back in the conversation with them. What happens when you speak to people more than once? You become familiar. The more they know you, the more they get to find out what a really good person, what a professional you are, what an ethical, honest, hardworking person, investor, or realtor, or whatever you do, how hard you are. They don't know anything about your character or personality. You're a stranger. Mom said, don't talk to strangers. And in the Claude Diamond Guts world, we have a thing called the 11th commandment. You can still get into heaven by treating a strange salesman like shit. Okay. So what you want to do is become familiar. Send up, listen, Mr. and Mrs. Prosper, I know we're not going to do business today, but um, I just want to share, I, I, I really enjoyed our conversation. You were so honest and straightforward with me. I'd like to send you a little gift. Is that all right? Boom. And you send them a little something, a book, a gift card, something. It doesn't cost much. Think about all the money you're wasting with all the gurus and all the dopey marketing that never works. Oh man, I God, I go crazy when I hear people spend thousands and thousands of dollars on, on marketing that fails 100% of the time. You're calling people who are being bothered. They don't react. And the ones who do react, they actually don't have any money or any inclination anyway. They're lonely, so they're gonna call you back because of your email or postcard. Do smarter marketing. I've done lots of videos on social media, virtual attraction marketing. But the best way to follow up on somebody and I'm gonna do another video on follow-up, is to give them a gift. It gives you the right to, to call them back. And a lot of times, they will call you back. Hey, Claude, thank you for the gift card. Thank you for the book. Really enjoyed it. Oh, well, good. Um, now, as long as we're on the phone, how did you make out? You must have sold that home by now. Boom. You're back in the, pro you're back in the conversation. You're gaining trust and respect, familiarity, rapport. I don't care what you call it. The more people you speak with, the more really good quality conversations. You only need a few. These people who go to me, oh, Claude, I made five of my auto dialer. I made 500 phone calls today. Yes, but they were all garbage calls. When you want two or three really good calls, that's all you need, quality phone calls, because you're a good gut salesman, aren't you? And nobody, nobody deserves success more than you. My name is Claude Diamond. I do answer my own phone, 970-281-5151, or go to my webpage, claudediamond.com, and you guys have a great day. Thanks for joining me. Bye-bye.